So, Thomas, tell me about your backstory. <sighs> well, Sonic, I don't really know how to explain it. It hasn't been a very good one. Well, what happened, Thomas? Okay, I'll tell you the truth. It all started way back in 1913. Me, along with my older brother Timothy, were building an engine workshop in the London Brenton South Coast Railway. When we got to the yard, I was so afraid that some of the engines wouldn't even like me. Pete and Steve, my other brothers, hated me. They said I was too clumsy. They bullied me so much that two other brothers, John and Mick, would always call me down. Especially Timothy. But when Timothy was sent to work on the island of Sodor, it happened. What happened? Something that would truly change my life for a whole year. On his first day on Sodor, Timothy was sent to pull a passenger train to the passengers home from Napa. It was all going well, but unfortunately, Timothy saw a danger sign right in front of him heading towards a cliff. He tried to stop, but he couldn't. He just kept rolling down a track. But then, it was too late. I wish I could say he survived the crash, but I'm afraid he didn't. When I heard the news, I was so devastated. Pete and Steve tried to calm me down, but it was no good. It was all over. The brother I was built in the workshop with was gone. Knowing I'd never get to see him again, my life had been ruined. In 1914, for the rest of the year, I was miserably depressed over the loss of my family. When I was sent to the island of Solo, I knew I had to carry on my brother's legacy. So I swung on by boat instead of by bridge, knowing that it would be a better place for me. When I arrived on Solo, I was impressing every engine on the road with all my heart shunting work. I helped him derail James after he had a bad accident on his first day on Solo. I even gained my very own branch line for all my bravery on that day. And on this very day, I still work on my branch line and build a really useful engine. Timothy would be so proud. If only Timothy was here to see me, I'd tell him about all the crazy adventures I had without him. Wow, Thomas. I'm very sorry about what happened to your brother. It must be hard living without someone that you cared about for all your life. It just hasn't been the same without Timothy. Why don't you come along and help me find the Chaos Emeralds, Thomas? That would cheer you up. Okay, that'd be a great idea to help calm me down. Alright, let's go!